hello my lovelies and you're welcome back to my channel it's so good to have you here today i'm going to be working on this black nails i already painted the nails and i'm going to be doing a design i saw on instagram so let's get to it on instagram i saw that they needed a silicone tool and a bunch of neon pigments like when i saw this design i'm like ah i need to do this and this is my first time trying it i saw the design and i had to like try to figure out a way to get it done so this is me trying to get it done this is my first attempt at doing it i'm going to post all my failures on this thing because although if i say i failed woefully i failed woefully before i finally got it so it doesn't matter um what's it called if you've been doing nails for a really long time when a new trend comes along well i have not been doing nails for a really long time but when a new trend comes along you want to try it out and it doesn't always turn out the way you want it to but what i would say is never give up i did not give up hallelujah <laughs> so um you just saw me apply the pigment on the silicone tool and now on the stamping tool basically on the stamping tool and now i'm going to be using um this um art gel now listen to what i'm saying i am using art gel 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 is what i am using here art gel so i'm just that's what i saw them doing the video they put the pigment on the stamping tool and then they put they shall put the white thing all over it so leaves me putting the white thing all over it and i cured that in the lamp for 60 seconds and when i brought it out my dear brethren it's not looking like what i saw in the picture <laughs> so i'm like what is going on this is not supposed to happen like this was not supposed to happen at all my client was looking at me like um just try to put it on my nails let's see i'm like auntie it didn't work like that too this is my second attempt because i'm like i am not going to give up i am going to try my best to get this so i decided to use the um colors in a different pattern try to you know create pattern and all of that my client was really really hopeful this is not a practice thing this is my client was right in front of me Look at, she was even helping me god i have the best clients in the world she was helping me pick colors helping me you know, jeremy on the oh don't worry you can't do it ah at this point i was like see my life outside in the public is this how i'm gonna be disgraced but anyways i kept on he kept a bold face i'm like don't worry maybe it's because i dried it in the lamp for 60 seconds the last time so we'll do something different this time with my confidence i slapped the gel out on rolled it over the stamping tool like ah, ah we will get it now it was from this point i should have known that i was messing up because the picture i had seen or sorry the video i had seen the was is it one minute video i had seen the white does not mix with the colors this was me trying to see if okay maybe they didn't cure it in the lamp before they put it in the lamp but since it didn't give me the same desired effect i'm like okay you know i'm going to put that in the lamp for another um what's it called another 30 seconds so i put it in the lamp for 30 seconds and it came out like this at this point i wanted to cry because i'm like what is this what no what rubbish is this so i'm like no never give up i clean my stamping tool wore my gloves because my hands were becoming messy and i didn't like that wore my gloves and i'm like i will get this thing today come rain come sunshine i will get it today so i continued on my endeavors creating more pattern as if the pattern was the problem from the beginning <laughs> she created more pattern my client was cheering me on don't worry you can do it you have it in you something 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 i'm like okay let's keep going and then she suggested my client suggested that oh maybe you're not putting enough gel on it 
and somewhere in my head that made sense to me <laughs> so i decided to pack the gel on top and created a beautiful mess took it put it in a lamp for 60 seconds and poof look at that look at that disgustingness at this point i'm like you know what let me just do another design for you because i suggested the design to her at this point i'm like let me do another design for you and then she's like no victoria don't worry just try try i'm sure you'll think of something i'm like okay let's do this one more time so i said to myself this is the last time i'm going to do this if i feel this time around i am not going to try it again but somewhere in the corner of my mind i'm like Kai, what the hell feel? Because my students were also there, my interns were also there, you know, trying to watch what I was doing and see what I was going to come up with. So I couldn't give up because of them, honestly. I couldn't give up because of them because that would just be teaching them that, oh, if you don't get it, let it go. And that's not something I want them to, you know, get used to doing. So I, after putting the um, tools on there, I thought to use something else other than gel. I remembered I had my acrylic paint. So I decided to use the acrylic paint instead. And from the get go, I knew this was the right decision because the surface remained white. And then I went to stand in front of the AC for it to dry. And this is my celebration dance. <laughs> I was so excited. I didn't know they were recording me and then you just press on the side, you know, to create a crack in the paint. So you guys, the trick is actually acrylic paint. That is the trick. So acrylic paint and then you leave it to dry. It dries on its own, like air dries it and you just press out to get that crack. I was so excited. Jesus, I was jumping inside my spirit and you just stamp it like you're using your stamping tool basically you just stamp it on the nail and oh! ah! you guys can see the table shaking because that's my client and i were literally jumping in our seats we were so excited <laughs> I'm sure you guys can sense my excitement from the way I'm even shouting into the voice over because I was really happy my client was happy everybody was happy like everybody was happy for us honestly <laughs> and this is the cutest design ever like it was so beautiful i'm like what sorcery is this my goodness I, it was it was epic for me it was really really beautiful now um this is what it looked like and i'm just going to apply top coat over everything you know to completely seal in the um design uh, i'm pretty much sure you can use it over any color you want but i just picked black because i saw them use black in the picture and my client wanted black she loves black like i'm always doing black for her so i'm like okay no problem um i'll try doing it over other colors and i'll post it for you guys to see at least now i have learned my lesson and i know what to do so there won't be a lot of merry-go-round but this is just to tell you guys that no. never ever ever give up on a design like don't do it never give up on a design and just keep trying your best to you know get the most out of whatever it is that you're doing like you get it. You get it at the end of the day. You see me feeling like a motivational speaker. <laughs> so, anyways, um, this is what we are getting, and I'm just going to clean off um, her cuticle area and um, clean off her cuticle area and um, make sure that there are no polishes around the nail to cause a disruption to the pictures that we're about to take <laughs> i'm so happy you guys like i am legit very very excited so yeah we're done with that and look at it it's so pretty oh my god apply my cuticle oil so that everything can be moisturized and perfect check out the reveals
now don't forget to like share subscribe comment and i'll see you guys in the next video bye, -bye.